valet Hispanicos celebrating 45 years at the Plaza Hotel's Grand Ballroom. And one day after being the toast of the town at the Bronx Ball and inducted into the Bronx Walk of Fame, the work of Eduardo Villaro, artistic director and CEO of Ballet Hispanico, is once again recognized, this time at its fundraising gala. He is planning the vision for the future, and uh, he is an unbelievable, a completely talented individual. He is so talented that it blows my mind. I um, grew up in uh, 177th Street uh, off of the Grand Concourse and uh, went to school in the Bronx until I have to leave for university and you know the Bronx made me who I am today. The company founded by Tina Ramirez 45 years ago has launched many careers over the decades along with Valaro honoree Linda Celeste Sims, a principal dancer with the Alvin Ailey Dance Theater also had her start at Ballet Hispanico. I was able to hang why? Because of my training at Ballet Hispanico. So, and it was interesting because, because I had that kind of, um, you know, background. When they came in, I was able to mold to whatever they wanted me to become. And that's when choreographers were like, we want to use her. And seated near a new generation of dancers, Ramirez shared her secret ingredient that has served so many of her former students. Anybody needs discipline in their lifestyle, if they want to accomplish something, they have they need this. It's something that's being passed on through the work of dancers like Nicolas Villanueva, rehearsal director for BH Dolls, the second company of Ballet Hispanico that trains pre-professional dancers. We go out into the community, to schools particularly, to do educational performances. So we're all about cultivating the young mind. And dancer Melissa Fernandez has been with Ballet Hispanico for four seasons. What we stand for is not just creating art, but it's touching lives, especially those of kids in underprivileged communities. We go to all the boroughs and we do outreach. And to me, incorporating the outreach elements with the performance elements of the main company, that opened my eyes even more. Monaco has been overwhelming, 45 years strong, and more to come for this pants company. For Bronx this is Arlie Makoko.